All right, this week on the Weekend Homestead, we've got our buddy Jerry out here. He brought his Kubota with the forestry mulcher. We're gonna run it around the property and connect all the four wheel trails together. When I originally purchased the homestead, it was a number of different pieces of property and what we had to do is put them all together to make it one large property. The issue was each property had its own trail system on it for ATV, hiking and doing all those things, but they never connected together. So this weekend, we're making short work of a project and cutting through all the different trails and taking down all the brush. In the springtime, we'll come back with the Kubota and the tractor and the brush cutter, clean everything up, mulch everything under, and plant grass and clover down on the trails. And we'll have a nice, easy hiking trail system throughout the property and it'll all be connected together. So if you wanna go from one end of the property to the other, you can hop in the gator and go all the way from the house all the way to the other end of the property, which is about a mile away. This trail system totals somewhere between five to seven miles. I'm trying to figure out the length of distances, but now we've got a whole bunch of new stuff, so I gotta figure it out again. But this is a really simple way to uh, take care of your property and make it easy. So one, you can cut the standing dead in your property and get them easily out of there because you have a nice trail system to transport wood on. You can get the family in and out as you need to on the property, use it for different things. It's gonna be easy to maintain, which is a great thing because last thing you need is something that's just a constant maintenance. This property and this project probably would have taken me over a year or two to cut all these trails together. So far today, we have about five hours into this project and almost all the trails are done. I'll take you along today and show you what we're gonna do. So saplings like this right here, get completely ground up and shredded up. Later on, we'll come in with a Harley rake and we'll rake this all smooth. That thing will just rip through anything. The carbide blades on its spin at 3,000 RPM and basically take anything out in its path. It's a powerful piece of equipment. If used wrong, you can destroy your property. What we did was we found the highlands where there's scrub trees, small saplings. We're just clearing out paths so we can have easy access. For the longest time, the lower homestead where the house is has never been connected to what we call the upper homestead where the barn is and the apple orchard. This trail that we're cutting would have taken us probably three weekends to cut. We've been out here for less than an hour and we're almost done because it's a really cool piece of equipment to use on your property to make quick work of hard work. Behind me this way, that trail right there goes right to the other homestead. These two properties were never connected together in about 100 feet here, we'll have the two connected, and then I can drive from the lower to the upper without having to go around or anything else, and it connects all of our trail systems together, the trail systems from the lower area and the upper area by coming right through this corridor. All the stumps, everything from that uh, pile are gone. He just drives right forward. He grinds everything up in his path. And see the larger trees like this one here and this one here, we're leaving those, but all this little scrub brush and poplar in here is all coming out. So what do we got here? What does this thing do? Well, this is a, they call the forestry mulcher. This particular brand is a Lofness. They make multiple different brands, but uh, so it's got a drum with uh, about 30 some teeth on it that just okay. spin around at a, at a high RPM. I'm not exactly sure. We're running about 3000 PSI on the wow. hydraulics. Okay. And, uh, momentum is just chewing thing it's got carbide teeth on it so these teeth just come right off of here then you just yep they're just these two bolts and you just unbolt it in fact i have one that if i can spin it i can show you one that i need to change oh, already that. Yeah, but, uh, i can't spin it it's stuck on the ground but all right i do have one sorry that, i can see them though yeah they look really good yep she does a lot of damage check out. awesome yeah. well we're gonna take down a tree now so check this out
So I wanted to show you this because a lot of people are probably asking, well, what's the trail look like when it's done? This is what's left on it. Just wood shavings, all these will decompose down and make a great uh, seed bed basically to plant on. Our hope is to get the seed down so we don't have any uh, issues with uh, erosion or anything like that. Plus, you know, it adds additional food and forage for the animals on the property. So this is uh, basically what I have now is uh, a whole bunch of trails covered with mulch, which will be easy to walk on, easy to take care of. We can take care of it with the Kubota and maintain everything. Who would have thought rain in January? It should be snowing right now, but it's raining outside. Unbelievable. Today I'm running the gator out on the property. Got all my equipment and everything out on it. Making quick work cruising the trails out here. Oh, I am cold, I am wet, and I am tired, but this project is going awesome. So today we got the forestry mulcher out on the property. We got our buddy Jerry out here today on the weekend homestead working on some of um, our trails. Over the last couple of years, I've acquired a number of different properties along this stretch, and each one of them had their own ATV trails, but none of the trails connected to each other, so we'd ride around on one, then we'd have to leave the property, go to the next, then leave, and then go to the next. Well, with this project that we're doing today, what we're doing is connecting all the different properties together. So now, you have something like this, where I have a trail here going this way, I have a trail going this way, and I have it coming together here. Well, now all of these trails have all connected together. And so now we can ride from one property to the next to the next, and it's very easy to get around on the property. Definitely a cool project. I'm glad we're doing it. It's uh, making it really easy to get around on the property and connect everything together. This has been the Weekend Homestead, living the simple life one weekend at a time. Thanks for watching. I do to my cameras to get good shots for you guys. Well, hopefully this one turns out. <laughs>